Alright. What's going on, dudes? It's Dove Code here. Welcome back to another video. Now, today we're here with Star Wars The Old Republic, and we're starting with a new character. So, this is the Imperial Agent. So, I'm not going to be doing a whole playthrough for every character. For every character but, um, the Imperial Agent is one of my favorites. So, I'm going to be playing it over again. Kind of. I haven't played for a while, so I don't remember anything about it. But, basically, my character is a proud Imperial. And he's going to be a darker character, dark side character. In the game, you get to be light side. Dark side. What's your dark side? The heroes are pretty, pretty evil. Um, my body down a little bit. Um, okay. So he's a proud imperial. Uh, he's really he's not too fond of aliens like imperials usually are. And there he is. So he's this imperial sniper. He's going to specialize in sniping enemies. Basically, he's a spy for an imperial uh, stuff. He's sharp. Sharp witted. He, uh, well, uh, I should talk a little bit back to the He, uh, I don't know, he's gonna be like, uh, very, very strict Imperial, loyal to the Imperial, Imperial stuff. Not to one Sith, not to one person who's loyal to the Empire. Really. It's pretty cool, too. But it's so weird because the point of him is he can blend in plain sight like this. He's going to get in place in plain sight. But he looks he looks so, somewhat obviously, obviously imperial to me. Everyone else here has like mangy hair. They don't have sharp facial sharp features like that. Sharp edges, edges like that. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like look at him. <coughs> Okay, so this is our room, I guess. Eh, it's okay, I guess. Nothing like the Imperial homeworld with German costs. Okay. Uh, oh, let's keep Secure it. transmission established. This is Keeper. We may speak so freely, Agent. So, the best thing about Star Wars Republic is you get, you get to make, make your own story by choosing different options. So, Secure transmission established. This is Keeper. You may speak freely, Agent. To I'm ready, sir. What's the assignment? In short, subversion. You were chosen for this operation because of your exemplary performance during training. Imperial intelligence needs agents capable of working independently in the field. Okay. Now you apply your training to the real world. Nemro the Hutt and his organization run Jaguna. Hmm. And you're in town to convince Nemro to supply the Empire. That's not a speciality. Because they say speciality, because they're so specialty. They're uh, British, so they say speciality. I want all the detail. Got it. I want all Give the me background. What are we working from? Daguna is an industrial town, and Nemro runs most of the industry. The hut supplies weapons, drugs, and raw materials, but not to us. We believe Nemro has been reluctant to lose Republic customers by publicly siding with the so Empire. So it's Republic then. It's time he overcame this reluctance. Agreed. You're absolutely right. We need to know what Nemro and his advisors are thinking before we can act. I want you to obtain access to the Nemro clan's inner circle. Excuse me? You require a cover identity. One of our contacts, an alien named G, has prepared G. a background for you and will provide the details. Cover identity. So who am I going to be? You'll be taking the role of a visiting pirate and trader. As I said, I'll be a pirate will give guys. You the details. Our she will be waiting for you at a safe house. Locate him, take what he offers, then report okay, uh, to me. Is, is he reliable? Are we sure this contact is trustworthy? Yeah, that's some, something my character would say. He's not fond of aliens. Whether he succeeds alien. at his assigned the tasks is say, another matter. Oh, I'd be more concerned with the rest of the populace. Blah, blah, Most of Jaguna is caught up in a turf war. Some of the gangs involved belong Imperials to the Huts. Risk, Others not, it's are not even like Imperials are... Low, Your low combat risk, training should see you same, through, uh, but expect brutality alien. and but expect like, to be talked like, to. Jaguna isn't friendly to strangers. Now, find now, G and report back to me. Then the aliens are out. kept around, and they can earn places in the Imperial military and stuff if they're very useful and stand up above the rest. But most aliens are um, lowly. So, um, uh, so I think we're set up, right? Let's go. There we go. Okay, uh, let me get my stuff set up. Rifle shot, overload shot. Have this here. I have everything I like, I like it. Also, um, we get to choose our 
specialty stuff. Comf okay, so medicine, uh, as an accomplished practitioner of medical art, the medicine, so I'm not gonna do any of these ones. Heal, I'm gonna do damage. Concealment, okay. Shock and shadows. The concealment operator, oh, I thought I chose uh, sniper. Oops, operator, okay. Operator surprises the enemy with a flurry of calculated attacks designed to stun and debil debilitate. Then, before the fight gets out of hand, the concealment operator can return to a position of stealth. Bite, biting their time until the time to, uh, to strike reveals itself again. Lethality. Now this one. Corrosive. Oh, that's, okay, I might choose this one. I think I chose concealment last time anyway, so this be better. Lethality officer firmly believes the one true gift that keeps uh, uh, on giving is poison. I can't read. Spinting potent got, uh, toxins using a variety of methods. Lethality operative attacks uh, take a toll over time. Crowing the enemy from within until all that's left with wither husk that only thinks it still has a chance. Okay, so we're gonna choose this one. So basically, this is like, so there are different classes. What's your, like, um, for a public, it's Jedi Knight, Jedi Consular, Trooper, it's like, uh, clone troopers, I guess, you've seen the prequels, and, um, smugglers, like Han Solo. And for the Imperials, and, uh, Dark Side and stuff, it's, uh, Sith, Sith, uh, Warrior, Sith Inquisitor, um, Bounty Hunters, and Imperial Agents. So yeah, and they used to have their counterpart, Jedi Knight with Jedi or Sith Warrior, Consular with Inquisitor, uh, Bounty Hunter, and Troopers, oddly enough, instead of Bounty Hunters and, and uh, Smugglers, and Smugglers and uh, Agents. And each class has two versions too. Um, like for instance, I'm not gonna go through all of them, but um, Imperial Agents have a Sniper and Operative. And then those classes have subclasses. So there's a lot of customization, I guess, for individuality of playthrough. And we're gonna take a long side quest, I guess. We don't have anything to boost our XP, so we leveled up. Uh, let's talk to this Nimro Stunning Droid. Then there's Messins, Nimro. Wait, Nimro doesn't know me. You know must me. be looking for someone else. Ma Credits are always good. Credits are money. Rule of Shaguna, citizens here, my city, some cities. It is interesting though, something that CinemaSins pointed out uh, in a video once that um, the characters in Star Wars speak flawless. Um, in any language, basically. They understand any language flawlessly and speak in any language flawlessly. It's not my kind of job. I don't trust you. <laughs> Straight up, I don't trust you. Well, yeah, like I said, uh, the Imperials hating cut or hating aliens. Huts, for instance, huts are useful, powerful, powerful gangsters. That's why they tolerate, tolerate huts. Let's get stuff from mailbox. Uh, I'm not sure if getting all this stuff that's going to look for each other. The top of fame more. I might get this. Um, I'll go. Should I just check them all as. Nah. Special forces. Um, actually, I might take this one instead. Just that one looks much cooler. I'll come back to this stuff, of course, because what these are are mounts, uh, so you can get around the world faster. But you don't get the ability to use mounts until le level 20. I think it is, or something around that. Um, special forces. One. So you can equip stuff to make your character look different, and uh, I have some free stuff, I guess, for buying stuff previously. I'll take the mask off so you can see my face. Ah, uh, this, this is obviously Imperial. I mean, of course it's obviously Imperial. Let's just keep it. I'm just keeping it because it's better, it's better than the default stuff they give you, I'm pretty sure. And of course, like, uh, along the way they give you armor uh, to go with the story. It has to be better than this. Jig! Jack G. Trodo no mares. Smogas total gis baba up your die. I'm expecting you. I have your new identity. Let's see. I'm listening. Continue. Vataranai ango mis akananuan. Alas protas air. No one else true species generate color. Gratai ap tikte. Iru prit pertini savasia sa vebe kaijis. If there's another red blade out there, won't that be a problem? Won't that be a problem, Jake? Because if he shows up, it's like, oh, this is 
Vataranai angomis akananon alas protas era. Okay, I'll just... That's bad. I'm not going to like this, am I? Carbejo pargi. Atrodo no malis. Smogas total gis babo apiatai. Ashley Imperial Agent twice once. Graitai apkipi. Iru priti pertini savasia saabebe kaijis. I was an alien. And they treated me somewhat differently throughout the stuff because of it. I have one uh, proposed solution. You quickly eliminate gang members on the Ugh, this is your mistake. In other words, you messed up and you want me to fix things. Oh, people are fighting outside. Small seal popudus mana ira padare mana nan kali. Graitai aptikti iruprit pertini savasia salvebe kaijis. Vataranai angomis akananon alas protas era. Jake, I just ah disappointed. I expected more from you. I don't know why. We just met, but I expected much, much more. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm being attacked. Now. I'm being attacked. Back off. Well, one difference between operative and stuff, uh, some smugglers also have, um, I can't remember the actual classes, but, um, one of the classes for smuggler and, and uh, agents get a second ability like this. So you can dodge them. Um, what sort of things are in the middle of the so this video, I'm going to end it, I guess, after I get to, um, the place and finish the quest, talk to the FG and stuff. So let's head off, rather than wasting time. Galaxy map, I don't have a ship yet, so I can't access the Galaxy map, so stop highlighting it. Let's go here, so I'll your mini map. Wait, inflict. Oh wait, no. I... I'm going here first. Duh. Okay. Okay. Um. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No mess with the red blade. Okay. Okay. I don't feel too, too long. I got. Too long. No one's gonna watch him. Honest here. Yeah. Take up this guy. Ow. What was that dodge? Okay. Let's grab this stuff. So, what I was thinking of about to hit the storyline, we got, um, Spaceport and uh, kill what's guys. Okay, uh, let's kill these guys. So, Fafa basically is a rival hut of Nemro. Nemro is going to be working with. So, he's an ally of the Empire. Well, he's going to be an ally of the Empire. So, Fafa is a rival of Upstart, according to Nemro. Nemro. Okay, let's go here and up those parts. Yeah, and I level up pretty fast actually. I switched out my gloves with the other ones for better. So let's see my armor will change. Gee, okay. That I had to kill people for those gifts, Jeek. This had better work. From this point forward, operational security will be at a premium. You will not contact us from this terminal again. Small seal popudus mana ira padare mana nan kali. Yeah. 
My character's a jerk, though, so I'm gonna try to stick to it. I understand you corrected Jake's mishandling of the situation, Agent. We'll now proceed. That creature didn't just mishandle he things, he messed, messed up badly. Up. Possibly, but we will Same use character. him until he's outlived his function. Your next task is to access Nemo's inner circle. Ah. Present yourself to the hut as a fellow gangster, the Red Blade, and offer him Jig's gifts. I'm not even red. One of the gifts is implanted with a listening device, which I'm we will use to monitor conversations within Nemo's palace. Are you listening for something specific? At this juncture, our primary goal is to find weaknesses in Nemo's organization. Uh -huh. Even if the hut won't join us, we might influence his lieutenants. Sorry. Talk to Nemo and his men. Determine who we can turn and how we can <gasps> sway them. We will be listening. Enjoy the show. In that case, I'd better watch my mouth. <laughs> I expect my ears can handle it, Blade. Be I'm careful what you say. One, guys. And my red blade is displayed. When you're in the hot palace, you're no longer an Imperial. Contact me from the cantina yeah. once Nemro has his presence. Keep her out. See you, Keeper. I kind of want to keep this outfit, though. Uh, there's an option later on in the game. Once you get more credits, to, uh, for... So you can have armor. That's to, that actually protects you here. Or here, you can have design stuff. So I can wear this stuff. Or I look like I'm wearing all this stuff, but wear something else, basically. And we're going to finish off the episode by, uh, talking to her, getting her quest, and, uh, heading over to the Nemo's Palace, I guess. Excuse me, stranger. I don't mean to be overly familiar, but I think you're just the kind of person who can help me. My coward of a husband has taken my son, and I need someone with the wit and muscle to bring him back. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> I don't Your care. Your marital problems aren't my business. <laughs> my marriage has been dead for years. This is about my son. My son is gifted. Do you understand me? Gifted in the Force. He has the ability to train on Korriban and become Sith. Uh, My husband trained on Korriban. He had his chance at glory, but failed. And now he runs errands for a slimy hut. I mm. will not have my son do the same. Please, you must help me. What's in this for me? I'm not wealthy, but I'd give everything I have for my son. Yeah. You've got yourself a deal. Good. I, saw I knew I'd find somebody right sensible now. eventually. He took my son to the shuttle port. A comm officer there who owed me a favor contacted me when they showed up. Be careful. My husband may not be willing to walk away peacefully. Okay. So we'll do that next time. Let's hold your palace. And stop in the main area of the palace, I guess. I'm not gonna go over there. We are not responsible for missed departures. Let's do this. It's faster. Oh, I just spaced through some guy. I just want you guys to hear the fake accent. That's pretty good. The guy had an imperial accent just to finish uh, some seconds ago. His fake accent is going to be on point. And of course, throughout the game, there are several things you can do, like romances, um, options that change the outcome of the story, and such. We'll be able to build the character, guys. And it can be pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. Okay. I think I'm from here. No. Uh. Lynn. Hello something. there, handsome. Hey, what's no, no, don't like? say anything yet. Play it casual. I'm an old girlfriend, and we're getting reacquainted. A mutual friend yeah, thinks it's guy. important that you acquire some new skills and weaponry. I've so arranged a contact in Jaguna to get, get you started. Skills. Now pretend we're all caught up and leave casually. I'll see. Sorry, buddy. I always hated you. So you're. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh, I get it. You work for Keeper too. I'm not gonna say that for you. Can exit out conversations. Hello like there, that handsome. To no, no. Do don't stuff. Need... Now pretend. <laughs> His, oh, so you want to keep a spice too? Uh, sorry, buddy. Oh, should I be nice? Yeah, I always hate you. Okay. Now I remember why we haven't talked for so long. You're a complete witch. Watch your mouth, Blade. Even you can be gotten to. Hey, that acting. Okay, guys, that's me for this video. I just you guys if you end up having liked this video, please 
you like. For more content, please subscribe and share with your friends. That'd be greatly appreciated. Stoke Quarter, signing off. Bye guys.